Well, we've uh, had two, you know, pretty good days of practice, and really, um, players have worked hard. And I think that everybody needs to understand the importance of um, when you play on the road, paying att attention to detail, staying focused, not being affected by external factors. It takes a little maturity, uh, leadership of older players affecting younger players to do the same, and. Um, very positive and how you got to approach uh, what you do when you play on the road. Um, you know, their team is probably one of the um, tougher, direct, downhill, running, two back. We haven't seen that this year. Uh, they're physical, they don't make a lot of mistakes, and you got to beat them. And defensively, they play the same way. They don't make a lot of mistakes. They play a lot of guys up in the box. They're pretty good in block protection and um, play a lot of man-to-man -man type of stuff. And receivers got to be able to get away from them. And uh, they've done a really nice job on special teams. They've got two really good skill guys, one good punt returner and a very, very good kickoff return guy. So a lot of challenges on special, special teams as well. Um, for our team, you know, we've given lots of guys opportunities, you know, this week at linebacker, and we'll continue to do that. And we really don't have anything specific to report right now. Um, obviously, Corey Reamer's got the most experience and uh, probably the most knowledge, you know, at this point uh, to be able to go in and play that position. And um, But that decision has not been made. Uh, however, you know, Dante's surgery went well. Um, talk to Doc about it and he thinks that uh, he'll have a full recovery um, and Nick Gentry has the flu and he's had it for a couple of days and missed a couple of days of practice um, so that's really pretty much it right now for the injuries Well, we actually played, you know, two thirds of the game last week with the guys in those positions, and um, you know, we. And to me, that's harder to do than when you get all the reps, because you know, if a guy gets all the reps in practice, he's much more prepared to do it in a game. I mean, Reamer had, you know, very few reps playing inside linebacker. I had a few reps playing nickel. Uh, because of his other roles that he plays on the team, and that's what he's practicing. Um, but we always discuss before the game how we would, if something happened to certain players, who would play and what we would do. Um, and the players know that, and they're prepared for it. And um, so there was no question about what we would do in a game. And it's probably the best thing for us to do right now in the short term, uh, to continue to do it that way. So... I, I, that's my feeling, but that's not that decision has not been made yet. Uh, before we heard about Nick, we hadn't heard much about the uh, the flu recently. Had it started the trial off with the team? Well, we got one guy that has it. I don't know if it has it, been an issue. Uh, in the yeah, we, we, it seemed to have gone away. You know, pretty good. Uh, we didn't have many guys sick last week. Um, Drew Davis was a little bit sick, but he really didn't have the flu. We've had a couple of guys that get the re upper respiratory part of it without a fever, but they kind of come back a little more quickly and respond better to medication. But when the guys get the flu, they're usually about three days. So I, I thought we were kind of over that, but I 